And today we're happy to now turn our attention to MacBook Pro. As you know, the MacBook Pro is the first personal computer with a retina display. A display with the pixel so small that at a normal working distance, your eye can't discern them, and the images are gorgeous. And now we've brought out both a 13-inch and a 15-inch Retina Display MacBook Pro, and both are having major updates today. First, let's start with the 13-inch MacBook Pro. It is an incredible machine, and now it is even lighter under three and a half pounds, just 3.46 pounds. And the new 13-inch MacBook Pro is thinner as well, just 0.71 inches thin. It's beautiful and thin and light, and it's incredibly fast too. New 13-inch MacBook Pro is powered by an Intel Haswell chip. This is a fourth generation dual core chip. And that chip includes Intel Iris graphics, integrated graphics that are even faster. In fact, they're up to 90% faster than the previous generation. So faster performance, faster graphics, and it gets better battery life too. Now up to nine hours of battery life for all the things you love to do. Reading your mail, surfing the web, doing productivity, and even watching movies that you've downloaded from iTunes. So if you're a fan of The Black Knight, as I am, you can watch the entire trilogy on one charge. Yes. If you're, if you're a Closet Batman fan, you don't have to hide it. It's faster, too, in terms of the flash storage. It's PCIe-based flash. That's 60% faster than the previous generation. Wi-Fi is faster, too. It has 802.11 AC. That delivers up to three times the performance over 802.11n at similar distances. And expansion is faster too. With the new Thunderbolt 2, it's up to twice as fast as the previous generation Thunderbolt. And all this performance and battery life comes in a brand new MacBook Pro that's running Mavericks. Craig just told you all about the incredible features and performance of Mavericks and the work of hardware and software together to deliver an incredible notebook experience. The previous generation 13-inch MacBook Pro started at $14.99. We're really happy to tell you today that this new 13-inch MacBook Pro starts at just $12.99. That's for a configuration with a 13-inch Retina display, 2.4 gigahertz, dual core i5, 4 gigs of memory, iris graphics, and 128 gigabyte of storage. And best of all, it starts shipping today. Next, yep. Thanks. Next, let's talk about the 15-inch MacBook Pro. This all-new generation MacBook Pro is powered by an Intel Crystalwell chip. This is a fourth-generation quad-core processor. It includes Iris Pro graphics. Now, this is integrated graphics that, for many tasks, deliver the same performance as discrete graphics, but it does it at a quarter less power. And for those who do want discrete graphics, there are models with the new GeForce GT 750M, and this is a graphics part with two gigs of video memory, twice as much as before. So again, faster processing, faster graphics, and longer battery life as well, up to eight hours of battery life. The new 15-inch MacBook Pro also includes the faster PCIe-based flash. It also includes the faster 802.11 AC Wi-Fi. It also includes new Thunderbolt 2 storage. So it's just better across the entire system. And of course, it comes with OS X Mavericks. Now the previous generation 15-inch MacBook Pro started at $21.99. Think you can guess what's coming. <laughs> the new MacBook Pro now starts at just $19.99. That's for a configuration with a 15-inch retina display, 2 gigahertz quad-core i7, 8 gigs of memory, Iris Pro graphics, and a quarter terabyte of flash storage. And best of all, it's also shipping today. As you know, we work really hard to make all of our products environmentally friendly, and these are both as well. NEG Star 6, EP Gold, Arsenic-free display, mercury-free display, BFR-free, PVC-free, 
and highly recyclable with all that beautiful aluminum and glass. So this is our notebook lineup, MacBook Air, MacBook Pro with the Retina display, two display sizes on each, 11 inch and 13 on Air, 13 and 15 on MacBook Pro, starting at just $9.99. So by far the best lineup we've ever had in incredible upgrades across the whole line. And that's our news for MacBook today.